Okay, hello. So I showed you through a little video how it was working. So here I killed everything to show you how to start from a basic modelized uh, Lego scene. So here you can see it's very basic. Uh, I rough shaped all the all the pieces. So here, if I move objects, you can notice there is nothing uh, nothing linked together. So just to show you how how I'm doing. Okay. Uh, so uh, first of all, I'm just gonna link this so you don't see the buttons but I select the select and link link sorry button here I link that to that so that right now if I move that my little con here is moving okay now let's select and link this here this to this and this to this so now here if I rotate this one everything is moving along okay here I'd made these as two pieces so let's link this one to this one so that now here it's moving okay uh, now here you can notice I've got uh, I created some points okay here and here which are the pivots the uh, the center of the little connections here uh, I suggest you create them too. Uh, notice too that the pivot, that the pivot point of this piece here is located here. Okay, it's aligned onto to this point here. Okay, you understand a bit further the reason. Okay. Uh, what to do right now? Uh, yeah, link the points to these pieces I don't know how they are named in English so let's say the green and blue pieces so that right now if I rotate the point is moving to okay so now if I look to my year key it's correctly it's correctly organized so now let's just uh, wire everything so the first thing I'm just gonna do is linking the rotation of this piece to this one okay how to do so go in select as you as you like select okay and here right click on it and click wire parameter and select the transform rotation and here we are along Z rotation check here onto the here so the Z rotation of this object will command the the Z rotation of this one and here appears this window so here it seems that my vertical axis here will command this green object Z Z and so I want this one to come on here so like so and click connect so now if I just rotate so it's directly linked okay we'll we'll adjust the, the value further now let's do the same same stuff here this one commanding this one okay same stuff select this one click wire parameter transform the its Z rotation will command the Z rotation of this blue piece Z same in this side let's repeat the demo okay here is a nice job already done okay now let's here link this object to this to the green object okay so now if I rotate this here you can notice it's quite funky what we're just gonna do here it's adding uh, so here my um, my grab viewport video is not correctly set it up I'm sorry but go into the animation menu go into the constraints and click in the and select the look at constraint and now you've got this starting from the pivot point of my red object to the point okay here it's aligned now rotate this and you can notice we've got a nice already 
done work okay it works quite well okay so now let's go, oops sorry I moved it let's just here go into a neutral, neutral. so uh, if you want this red piece to stay correctly horizontal here you have get to be sure that the point here is aligned onto the pivot because it's looking at so if I here move this point here check what it gives okay so be sure it's at the same level Z level now we just have to animate this one so very easy if you had understood wire parameter the Z rotation will command the Y rotation in that direction connect let's make a quick check okay so here you can notice there's a problem of speed between the rotation speed of my vertical and horizontal axis and the rotation of the wheel supports okay so I tweaked a little bit in before doing this video uh, go here in the wire parameter uh, sorry so to do that here select this object go into your animation menu and go in the wire parameter and in the parameter wire dialog here select the Z here and we said it was commanded by the vertical axis so where is it? it's here okay so here it will be uh, oh what happened divided by P click update let's rotate again here you can notice better but there is a problem here it's not rotating and translating the, in the right direction look it's in opposite so we just have to repeat here in the animation menu wire parameter 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 wire dialog and here uh, go into this transform rotation V and here select here into this vertical X and the rotation Z rotation and here we just have to say this take the opposite and click update uh, sorry and if we rotate here it's correctly fitting okay hope you understood what I tried to explain uh, if there are any other problems uh, you can PM or uh, ask me uh, other other informations okay see you bye